getting the better of Canada's Kevin Bosajor, having beaten Desmond in Amsterdam quite comfortably. Lopez also very, very comfortable in his route. Juan Rigo always wears that concerned look. Rionid Hanovic from Latvia, the man in the middle. Lopez Cuba in the red. On a rego. He's worked hard to get here. You like to see boxers like this get their opportunities. They clearly do the hours in the gym, do everything right. They have got the flamboyance of a Lopez. But this is their reward. The place on the big stage in the semi finals, a chance to go to the Olympics. I do think though Lopez Cardenia needs to have an off night. And he doesn't have many of them. Going exactly as I think we expected, worthy from Juan Arrigo. Good boxing coming in from Lopez. Second time, though, is his trip. Very unlike him, he's normally such an elegant boxer. But he has the reach advantage. Sure, what Bonarigo came in at weight wise, but I suspect he's a, a few kilos lighter than Lopez. And absolutely solid. seconds to go of uh, the first round that hasn't exactly lifted off as yet what, what is going on with his balance today three times now in this first uh, round snakes that right through Hoping to be stuck in the corner because he knows he can box his way out of there there we go Always has that slightly concerned look. To the top of the gloves, apology as the last shot came after the bell. Worthy applause, but no doubt in at the boxer. Manages to get the points. That's a body shot. Tags him. In the corner, yeah. to duck through and set up uh, the lovely right challenges the chin of Bonarigo confirmation all five judges Arlen Lopez Cardona
Simona Buonarigo looking for a way to get in. He's such a perfectly balanced boxer, Lopez Cardona. Normally, <laughs> see there, he had a uh, three chips in the first half. Very unlike him. But the defense is immaculate. Doesn't seem to be any space between those gloves. And he finds the space between the gloves of Buonarigo. Well, within his comfort zone, Lopez. Not remotely as spectacular as the 60, 63 and a half kilo semi final we've just uh, come off the back of. Very, very professional from Lopez Cardona. Picks his shots. The jab worries Buenarigo. Oh, nice, nice, nice. the craftsman at his job quick raid three four punches in a row have scored points five six Bonarigo tries to get one off the back again a kind of a, a pat on the back like the master teaching his uh, students what to do, and Buenarigo is, is worthy. Largely outclassed. Literally picking his shots. Buenarigo's achievement was getting to these semi finals. Wonder if he's able to take the chance, but when you're up against a, a master craftsman, judges Marlon Lopez Cardona controlling this contest. Vondele Pereira and Cedric Veloni Dulyapre from Haiti await in the second semi final, which is immediately after this. Respect from Lopez. Bonarigo. Again, will just try and work his way into the into the bout. One, two, three lefts. Just career through the hole. And break that guard. And Rigo probably thinks that guard is safe, but no, oh, the power that comes through from Marlon Lopez. And again, that right snakes through. Reddening around the nose, indicative of how many times he's been tagged in the face. <laughs> well, 
the two whistles from the crowd. It's a little bit unfair because uh, the Cuban is doing exactly what he needs. I'm sure if it did get to a brawl, he'd be able to cope with that as well. But Abraham Bonarigo just trying to keep his self respect in this semi final. He's again the craftsmanship. Tap, 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 tap. seconds remaining of this uh, masterclass of its own kind he had a job to do he's gone out and done it a place in the final is assured for Arlen Lopez Cuban 30 years of age he started Guantanamo go back to 2009 when he was featherweight world junior champion Picking up international titles since 2014 when he won the Central American Caribbean Games. He's got another final looming here. And he doesn't lose many of these finals when he gets there. Double Olympic champion. Double Pan American Games champion. And now in a third final in a row. Pretty straightforward, I think, for the judges. A unanimous decision. All five judges, all three rounds. Congratulations for a brave effort. This is a, a world-class athlete. The top of his game. Apparently strange loss of balance in the, the first round. Where Three times he lost his footing. Even slight marking on the nose. It wasn't perfect. That was far too good for Abraham Bonarigo. Perfect scorecard. Sets him up for another final.